Right, Evans. Hey. Round three. Hey. Where are we at? How are you feeling, man? Oh. Confident. Full. Yeah, man. Yeah. Two from two in the old yeah. toss, man. <laughs> yeah. What do we got here? We've got the Charmate Grady. Yep. And hey, what's that big one over there? Charmate Colt 48. Whoa. Tails. Ooh. Yeah. Hey, oh. That's a heads, mate. You sure? Yes, yeah, just move the grass and it goes. Heads. Okay. Heads, mate. So I'm going to go, I'm going to go the Grady. You're going to have the gonna Grady? going to go the Grady. That's Always what I, wanted to use one of these. I wanted the 4.8 anyway. There you go. What do you got under there? It's so I'm a hawk, so, <laughs> so I hope I don't butcher them. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Bit of pressure all of a, a sudden. Bit of pressure with the old steak, mate. What have I got? Oh, beautiful. Oh, Favourite of mine. Short. As I've done two, murdered yes. one. Yes. Nailed the next one, so mm. quite confident with this one, Pete. Oh, 50% chance. Sounds good. There we go, eh? Hey? Beef short ribs. Right, I'll go put a bit Can't of rub. Get that one. Can't overdo that one, can you? Is. Yeah. Why are you doing that, mate? I don't know if you. What are you? Well, I'm going to hang my tomahawk steaks in my uh... in my Colt 48. Yeah. Oh, just like that. So I'm running the uh, the bulldust meat rub, uh, all purpose, but for today, right. going to chuck it on my uh, tomahawk steaks. Key here is make it heavy on the seasoning. Got to really coat them thick. To a point we don't really see the meat. Take a look at this. Bit of blackout, eh? Bit of beef. Check a bit of flavour on that. You reckon beef? Jeez, it looks impressive. <laughs> oh, <we're pretty. laughs> hey. Here we go, baby. Right, let's go get these in. <laughs> oh, yes! Yes, beef! <laughs> Grab the lid off my char, mate. Colt. 48, would you? Yeah, so what do you need me to do? Yeah, I need you to flip that lid a little bit. Yeah. And I need to hang these. Tomahawks. Yeah. And we get them in. We'll, we'll put them side. We'll put them about there. Yeah. Beautiful. And if you might want to do the honours, I'll just make sure you travel, travel yeah. well. You have, have happy? Yes. Yes, I am. Yes. Very good. Vents are open. Should we lock her? Yeah, I think we should just in case that wind kicks up and locks her over. All right, got my beef short rib. Got the blackout rub on it. Gonna chuck it in the char mate Grady. For a couple of hours and just keep an eye on them, eh? Here we go. There we go. See you, darling. All right, Beef. Yes, I'm looking forward to this. There we go, mate. The char mate Grady has been slowly cooking my beef short rib for about six, eight hours. Yeah, it's been a while. And, uh, it's been on there for a wee while. And she's just perfect right now. She's ready to take out and have we taste. You ready? Beautiful, I am ready. Right, I'm a bit nervous here. Holy hecka. What do you reckon there, mate? Looks pretty good, eh? Looks pretty good to me. Mm. Riders, yeah, want to get these off now, mate. So. What have got under here? Oh, yeah, I've got my tomahawk steaks, haven't I? Hey? Right. So lift them up. What are we looking like there? Oh, beauty. They look just how I wanted them. Put them there. Just gonna let them sit there for a bit. Is yep. leave that lid off. Yep. I just want to create a real flu there effect, so I can then just serve them off just in there. Off. Oh, yeah. Nice. There we are. We'll, uh, debone it. Debone it. Cut them up into nice little slices for everyone, and then put a bit of garnish on them. Cheers. First time cooking a uh, tomahawk steak for me is. What do you reckon? How have I done? I reckon. Well, look at our face. <laughs> Tells a lot. Man, that is so succulent. You've absolutely nailed that. Thanks, man. Medium rare. Mm. 
Well, as give me a rating from a first ever on Tomahawk's Day. I'm a bit wary because all of Eden is yours, so I can't score you too high. Yes. But thank you. What I get nine for your chicken wings? Mm. 9.12. Better. Yeah, better. Better than my wings. Love mistake. Love mistake. Pretty good. So my wings were 9.5. I'm giving this 9.4. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, chicken mm. wings better. Oh. I mean, if you had to decide. I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I have waited for this. <laughs> I have waited have for it, this. Yeah, have it, yeah. Perfection takes mm. time, my friend. Mm. Good. You've done well. You really have. Perfection takes time. No. Obviously, <laughs> a lot of waiting around. That's all about the end result. It was worth the wait, it was worth, it was the, worth wait. the wait. We're going to have to give this a score. For me? 8.9. I'm giving you 9.1. Oh, hold on. Mm. Nice. Very nice. Babe, we've obviously had a little bit of a count up of the scores. Yes. And uh, it's come back. Yep. Tomahawk. Yes. Obviously very, very, very well done from you, my friend. Oh, it was a close fork Cooked thing. A close fork succulent thing. Succulent and juicy, so that was uh, always on the cards. That was over on my char, mate. Number two. Yes. Chicken. Chicken. Not the chicken wings. They were very good, but the whole chicken. Whole cooked, smoked chicken. You want to know what's third? Salmon. Salmon? Yeah, salmon. You know, salmon was very nice. Salmon with cream cheese. Yeah, salmon won the seafood competition. Appreciate it. Are you taking this? It's been this? a tough couple of days for you, my brother. <laughs> Are you taking but this? Back to the cooking board. And uh, good luck next time, eh, Mike? Let's wrap it. Let's okay. <laughs>